Incorporated Lawrenceville and Unincorporated Norcross. In each case, he smashes through the windows with a rock or brick and then goes after cash drawers and safes. Police tell us he stole nearly $3,000 in cash and property. We had a very nice Tuesday getting ready for another cold night. Yeah, let's get right over <laughs> to our chief meteorologist, David Chandler. It's going to warm up tomorrow, right? It is going to warm up. That's going to set the stage for the next several days. So this is kind of our last really chilly night across North Georgia in the foreseeable future. And probably right on through the spring. How about that? 42 is where we're headed right now, or where we are now in Blairsville, headed to the 30s. 51 in Gainesville, 53 down in Noonan, already 48 there in LaGrange. So as we go hour by hour, we notice that we see a lot of 40s out there, low to mid 40s around town, but some 30s up there in the North Georgia mountains, so that's rather chilly. As we make our way through the day tomorrow, look at that. A lot of sunshine. Today we only hit 64, down below the average. Well, tomorrow we go above the average and into the lower 70s in a lot of spots with plenty of sunshine. So here's the deal now. The weather snapshot we're working on is a clear and cool conditions tonight. Our last chilly morning. Perfect day on Wednesday and warm through the weekend. We've got some showers and storms and we have to dodge. We'll get to all that coming up in about 20 minutes. All right, we'll see you in just a bit. Thanks. Great news tonight for thousands of people in DeKalb County. Today, the county started installing new water meters to replace more than 100,000 defective ones. It's all part of a three year project to correct an ongoing issue that resulted in numerous billing errors. The county expects to replace about 30,000 water meters and do so this month alone. Customers will be notified with a door hanger once the installation is completed.